you know I'm excited. Another GT3. And I love the key. I always love the keys because they match. It's the same color as the car. And the key is on the left side of the steering wheel. And the reason they do that in Porsche is because they want you to start the car and put the car in gear at the same time. <laughs> Let's go. Let's turn all the options on. Exhaust, PDK Sport, suspension. Let's get straight to business. because he wanted the RS and I can't blame him because so far this thing is pretty sick um Uh, LS 
drift car with the uh, he made 500 to the wheels and this thing is ridiculous dude this is a different 500 horsepower <laughs> it feels insane this car is ridiculous like they make the turbo version of this right the gt2 the gt2 is a turbo version it has 700 horsepower you don't need it you really don't need it like i i like horsepower but this is enough i'm fine with the gt3 i don't think i want a gt2 i'm lying <laughs> anyways yes rob had two gt3s he sold both of those got the rs and now he's actually thinking about selling this too not that he doesn't love the car he absolutely loves the car but he doesn't love the color he thought about wrapping it but he's like i'd rather just sell it and he might get something else so i don't know so i mean it's not 100 percent sure um i'll leave his contact info like right here is instagram and if you interested in the 2018 miami blue gt3 rs with uh less than 7,000 miles on it you know where to get it and um it runs great so favorite things about this car now you know me i love manuals
last time. This is a car that just doesn't get worn. And you have so much confidence in it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, y'all want to hear 9,000 RPM? Sounds a little something like this. the gt3 it's got this awesome alcatara steering wheel with the, the yellow stripe in it and i mean it's just this thing is sick you have uh these straps over here in the corner for uh pull straps for the doors it's not an actual like regular door handle just like true race car stuff i mean it's a, it's a beautiful car you can take it to a car show and then you can take it straight to the track it's 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 amazing i don't really know any other way to put it this car is amazing car never gets old gt3 is hands down still one of the best cars you can ever buy some people argue that it's not an exotic because it doesn't carry the name like lamborghini or ferrari this thing is probably more fun than a lamborghini or ferrari now i won't speak too soon i won't speak too soon i haven't drove one yet i have drove a lamborghini huracan years ago before youtube i need to drive one again but um this thing is amazing. So as far as practicality, um, you can still, like I said, you can drive this car like a regular everyday car. I mean, Rob drives it pretty regularly. Um, I always see it, you know, going down the highway sometimes. It stands out a lot with this beautiful color that he doesn't like for whatever reason. I mean, he can go black or white. I mean, he's probably more of a simple guy than me. Me, I like flashy colors. My M3 is yellow, you know, I get it. <laughs> but um, I mean, you got AC. You got everything you got your navigation and stuff over here and thank god it has a reverse camera because you can't see anything out of the back back window you got the roll cage in front of you you got the seats you got the harness you can't even turn that far and then you got the big old wings so, i mean thank god this thing has a very good uh wide open um reverse camera because backing this thing up in a parking lot you can't see nothing man even looking in the mirrors, all you see is Fender. <laughs> That's gonna be the last pull. Deuces. See you in the next one.